Welcome to a video from the JustLifestyle.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can roll back to a previous version of Windows 10 after you've installed a major update. Now, it could be there's something causing an issue with your device, or maybe a bug in Windows 10, or, or you're a Windows Insider, you're testing it out, and you need to go back to a previous version. There's a built-in tool to do that in Windows 10. You've got a limited period of time to do it. I think it's around 30 days before it cleans up. And if you've done the disk cleanup operations, then that will also uh, get rid of that um, build as well. So I've got a separate video actually how to clean up your disk images, um, and that does get rid of the previous version. So you see here I'm on build 19013, which is a Windows Insider Fast Ring build. And let's say I had an issue with this and had some problems. And go to recovery, and I can say go back to a previous version. So you could have just updated to a new version of Windows 10, and you have an issue with it. You can do that update. And what this will do now, this will start the process off of rolling back uh, Windows to the previous version. You've got to make sure you're plugged in on power. Uh, so let me just plug the power in. Okay, so I've plugged in now, so let's um, see what this does. So basically what's going to happen now is it's going to reset this back to a previous build of Windows 10. So I can put Y, so I can put for another reason. And I can put testing. Well. So I can put a reason in. And I can say, no thanks, I just want to go back. So there we go. So this is now going to restart the machine into the familiar sort of Windows update screen and uh, it's going to reinstall the build uh, or it's going to reapply the previous build, so build 19.005. It will keep your files and if you had any files um, and applications it will keep those. Um, but you won't get this new build and then I have seen where it doesn't offer you this new build again because you may have rolled back for a reason but we'll see about that later so I'm going to let this run now it's going to take some time for this to process so I'll pause the recording and resume it when we get to the uh, Windows login okay so we're back at the login screen now let me sign in so here we are back signed in now notice the build now is 19008 it took about five minutes actually, it was relatively quick that in, on, on this virtual machine. And we're back in this pr previous build now. I can go and check. So I can do a check for updates now and see if it finds that uh, 19013 update. I think oh, it's seen that update, so it's going to bring that down now and I'll be back on that uh, previous build. So that's how you roll back and that's put this back on that previous. Uh, build a Windows 10, so yeah, so if you have any problem with your build, you can roll back like that. Got more tips on how to use Windows 10 on our YouTube channel. Uh, give us a subscribe. Uh, you can find me on Twitter at isdixon and on the digitallifestyle.com.